One thing I figured out in retrospect was that remembering my roots and where I was from and how things all began really helped me to get to where I'm at today. So today we're in my hometown, Kaiser, Oregon, population 40,000. The fact that it was slow and there's not as much going on, you know, that helped me stay in tune to the game. My parents kept like a great record of everything I did from, you know, print magazine articles to um, all pictures we took as a little kid. I think my dad had just like introduced me to Gamer right here, two years old. After he got a little older, we started putting hoops up in the garage. We used to play one-on-one uh, -on -one out there and it was an absolute bloodbath. Even at a young age, it was really tricky. Yeah, Grayson was always in the driveway till like midnight, or if we weren't home, then he'd be out there like all night. He woke up thinking about basketball. For me, it's a blessing to have a big platform and to have come from such a small town. Salem, Kaiser area, not known for basketball players, that's for sure. You, you know, you look at the odds, and, you know, what were the chances that that could have happened. When I was growing up, we just called this a skate park. But this is like really the only street ball vibe that was in the Salem Kaiser area. I found out about the N1 mixtape tour when I was in about eighth grade. That just got my mind thinking in a whole nother way in regards to basketball, as far as like the creativity, the crowd energy, and then the environment. When he started taking a liking to the park, it was really the start of the street ball movement. He was down there probably four or five nights a week playing in the park where <laughs> He kind of developed a name for himself. This was really my first exposure to playing with players who were like real rugged, real physical, athletic, and then some guys might be like twice my size. Like it was good for me, you know what I mean? It was a, it's like those growing pains you need on the court to develop as a player. We often thought, you know, what is he doing with all this basketball? What's, where is this gonna lead him, you know? Just what he wanted to do is just his whole everything. Mm -hmm. 